We citizens, European citizens, Hungarian citizens as well, we need to be f feel safe, we need to feel respected. We have a task as European Parliament that if a government is no longer assuring that, others step up. Two weeks ago, I gave my first presentation and I went over the content of the report. And as I explained, and I find it important to explain this again, all of the, the things I'm saying are rooted in reports by highly respected bodies, such as the Council of Europe, the OCSE, and the UN. As this is the first time the European Parliament does such a report, I find it important to have it based on facts and the content double-checked. I conclude that the plenary was right when it said that the current situation in Hungary represents a clear risk of a serious breach of the values in which the Union is founded. Again today, although out of the ordinary, we have allowed the Minister to give his view to the draft report. I'd like to briefly remark the report in front of you. It's a collection of lies, blatant lies. The rapporteur took everything to the account when, it, when she uh, cooked up this report, but not the facts. It is a window trial, after all. I am very appreciative of the fact that you made it possible to speak in this House, but we still not accept that you are spreading lies about Hungary here in this House. Therefore, I will write a factual um, refutation of all the points in the report. Thank you again for the possibility of being here and talking. What I do not understand is being so polite to allow the Hungarian government to come to us time and time again, then I expect the Hungarian government to be governmental. I'm not talking to a political party here, but to a minister that represents a government. It is your freedom to speak here and to say what you want and you think is needed to say. I think we should continue to have a respectful debate in this House. The next step, Chair, is the amendment procedure. I'm working towards that and I will work towards that with all the colleagues that are, uh, that are shadows and I look forward to your proposals. Thank you very much.